I can show you the world. Da na 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 something. I don't know how the lyrics go, but welcome back to more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. I'm Wing Plays, and I play with your mom. And oh man, you guys are gonna hate me. I'm sorry. That was a really bad joke. But we're here back, Dragon Roost Cavern, and uh, we're gonna continue. Uh, we're gonna grab one of my sticks, and we're gonna let it on fire. Like I said, kids, don't light your sticks on fire. Oh god, bats. There's a chest right there, but where'd the bats go? Oh, they just vanished. That's not scary at all. Okay, something. I see a dark shadow coming from that direction, but I'm not gonna go that way because. Oh, more bats! Where the hell did you guys come from? Okay, just camera stop freaking out. There we go. Come on, come on. Die, you bats! Like the first sign of actual enemies that we've had, except besides those, those monsters. Oh, joy pendants. These are. These are needed much later in the game, though. Um, but I recommend you collect a lot of them now Because oh right here very nice if you hit this with your sword It will drop a bunch of random shit and in this case it dropped a bunch of rupees and I need another steak so Take this one, but this time I'm lighting on fire over here so I can save time duh. That's smart All right, and there we go. We unlocked the door And there's nothing else here. All right. I don't want a stick. All right. I said I'll write like five times in that little sentence, but uh, this is one of those moments where you want to be very careful because you will fall and you will die. Ha 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 ha, that's not funny. That's not funny, Wing. Dying is very serious. We're trapped. Alright, so finally some enemies. Get up, bitch. I missed. There we go. Gotcha. And you're dead. Anybody else want some? You would assume there'd be a lot more enemies in this room because, you know, they locked the door. Like, rape, man. Although this is like pot heaven. I mean, pots, not pots, you know? Not the, the drug. I'm talking about the actual item, the pots here. Find a bunch of rupees in them. God, you guys are so nasty. Sheesh. <laughs> Okay, what the hell am I supposed to do with my sneak? All right. I, oh, there's another torch down there So I'm gonna assume I'm supposed to light that on fire <laughs> I'm, I, What the fuck I feel like all right if you guys are curious why I'm so energetic in my videos um, I have two pounds of cocaine every time I begin my recording so <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I, I, I'm just kidding a little bit All right, fine. I don't do cocaine Alright, I don't do two pounds of cocaine, are you happy? I do one. Maybe five. <laughs> anyway, we found a treasure chart. Um, this is very useful for later in the game. Well, not later in the game, but usually when we're out to seas, we can find some treasure when we get an item, which we're going to get in this dungeon, actually. And ooh, what am I supposed to be doing? The door is locked. Okay, I dropped the pot. Oh, another joy pendant. Alright. Like I said, these are fairly useful. Oh, what the f- Why were you hiding in a pot? I don't understand that. They do more cooking than I do to fit in there. I have an idea. I'm gonna stuff myself in a pot. Oh, it'll be brilliant. All right, I'm assuming that there's more enemies and more pots. So I'm gonna try and smash all of these. Smash. Dust monster smash. Yup, there's one of them. You guys are brilliant. What the- What the- What the- That was weird. That was- Okay. I hope that was last one. Yeah, it was. Alright, now the door's unlocked and we can keep going. I can show you the world. Now that song from Aladdin's gonna be stuck in my head. But I only know that verse. It's very weird. Oh my god. I need to complete this dungeon soon. Oh, right here. This is what I meant early in the last episode when I meant that these things will be your worst nightmare. They are! If they fall in the lava, they respond perfectly fine, and then they try and knock you off. So you need to be very, very careful with these things. Damn it. Alright. There has to be a certain way. Something I'm doing wrong. Oh my god, that was close. Okay. No, I didn't want to smash the pot. I just want to pick it up. Okay. Yeah. This is what I meant. That's exactly what I meant. Oh, man. Uh, is there an easier way to destroy this thing? Because I'm gonna have- I'm gonna be here for a while probably because of a stupid thing. These are your worst enemies. I don't know what they are. They're like these lava s scorpion things. I'm not sure. 
Um, maybe I can just avoid him completely. No! Good job! <laughs> Alright, hopefully I'm on the spot. Okay, good. Haha, <laughs> bitch, I'll see you later. Elevator time. Wah! Alright, the timing was a little off there, but it's fine. Whatever. Alright, enjoy you, your mom. Boo, do, 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 do. Alright, there's a bunch of more skeletons here. This kind of makes me nervous. Like, why are so many people dead? No. Alright, bombs. Yeah. Explode! Alright. Now, this is what I meant by with the Shrek farts. Like, you jump into that and reappear in that room by the beginning of the dungeon. Like, because you want to leave and you want to restock on some things. But I'm not going to do that because this dungeon isn't in need of that. Because it's very simple, actually. So, um gonna keep going this is actually a really long dungeon which I like I'm not really long it's a long dungeon and we're here at Valu very nice someone's on his period all right all right I thought when I was oh yeah I was right I was about to say I thought when I was a kid these stairs fell when you ran on them and yep I was right this look doesn't look ominous at all Oh no, they have my bitch. I mean, medley. Let her go. Get up. Get up. <sighs> you think you all that? You fancy, huh? You fancy, huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bitch. I wish they had the fatal blow in this game. It'd be a lot more fun and easier. Oh, and this guy. Yeah, you remember this guy from Forsaken Fortress? Yeah, this little butthead. Um, now we can fight him. This time he doesn't capture us and put us into prison. Now I want that joy pen at first. Come on, come on, swing at me. Swing, swing at me. Alright, I'm. am I doing something wrong? No, I'm not. <clears throat> Get up. Alright, I think that's the last hit for him. Nope, he's still alive. Alright, he just tried to swing at us with his hands. Bad idea, pig boy, bad idea. Alright, I'm assuming that's the last one. And I was right, yeah. My assumption was correct. Ha ha ha. Alright, uh, as you see right here, we have a skull necklace. You can keep it in your spoils bag. This rather off putting accessory would appear a little value and show the right person and apparently great worth. So later, we might need this for something. I don't know what yet, but uh We freed Medley, that's very nice. Wing, you came to rescue me. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're gonna give me the loving now, right? <laughs> I have to tell you what I found out. This is terrible. Some creature is doing awful things to the Great Valor's. Oh, that's gay? That's why he's so angry. Yep, that's gay. The Great Valor's tail hang down in the middle of the room, right? Blah, blah, blah. There has to be something in there. I oh, want the mean monster's gonna capture me. I have something to do with it. We've got to do something now, before it's too late. I'll go and tell everyone what's happening. Here, we can use this to get out of here. It's what I used to get this far. It's a device we Rito used before we evolved wings. God, then, this thing must be really old. We have the grappling hook, our item for this dungeon. Very nice item, actually, if I do say so myself. I heard gunshots. I live in the hood. That's an everyday thing, so whatever, don't worry about it. Uh, uh, I'll be fine. <laughs> I remember on New Year's, I was in a Skype call, and then my friends thought I was dying because I was yelling. That was fun. Yeah. Now, she's basically going to teach us how to use the grappling hook. When I already know how to do it, um, just basically aim for that, and then it will wrap it around, hit by some physical thing. Even though I threw it way too high for it to be able to do that. But, uh, whatever. It's all the physics, so... That looks awesome, though. I wish I had one of these. I just jumped, like, around in my room. Or like play limbo with it or something. I don't know. So I'm something I would do. It's only something I would do, guys. I'm too awesome, guys. Which is why you guys should subscribe. I'm pouring myself up for subs, guys. <laughs> My rich guy laugh. <laughs> Even though it sound like Paris Hilton and uh, Christopher Walken mixed up. Whatever. Ugh, I'm just mumbling on now. What the hell? All right, and now that we have the grappling hook, we can access down here. And in this room. Oh, what? That's. Should I help him? No. <laughs> Bing. 
All right, right. If you hit certain enemies in certain places, it would. Oh, mmm, that was that was really bad. All right, I'm guessing this guy doesn't have anything, so I'm just gonna kill him. Um, I thought he would have had like a joy pendant or something, but yeah, completely useless. You're useless to me, sir. Okay, now remember how I said this entire dungeon? Do not, and I repeat, do not cut the bridge. You know what we're gonna do? Yeah, we're gonna cut the bridge. <sighs> Try this one more time. All right, just two more strings left, and then we'll be done. And now we fall. <gasps> And then we fall perfectly aligned to the little place below. And right here we have a joy pendant. Like I said, um, I already have like five of them. I only think you need like 20 something or 30 something. I'm not really sure. But by the, it's around the end of the game where we're going to need these. But um, I'm not going to spoil what it is. Because for those of you who probably never played a Zelda game, which you should kill yourself for. I'm just kidding. Don't, don't do that. But um, we're going to do that. And this is going to fall down and it's going to make me poop my pants. So ready? Ugh, that was scary. And now we appeared over here. I'm not sure. We have to do some platforming. Platformer. Link is not good at. Platformer. Take it like a man. I don't, what? That was weird. Alright, now if I remember correctly, there's a switch. There it is. Now, if you pull this switch, that door is going to open. God, I'm brilliant! Okay, bats, that's not cool. Alright, I'm trying to get the, the key, the big key, before we end up going on forward. Before the episode ends. So, that's probably what I'm going to aim for right now. And you could also adjust your direction by um, hitting R to stop and... I have a time limit, really. Oh god, that was close. I thought I was getting... Well, that wasn't close at all. What the hell? I'm panicking over nothing. Ah. Alright, we're almost there, I think. In this room, there's a key. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not 100% sure about a lot of things in this dang game. Alright, there we go. Oh, I know this room. This room's a dick. Alright. Now oh, we have to fight those creepy crawlies of death and doom and destruction. We're not exactly fight them. We have to stun them. Really, I don't really know what else to call it. Don't fall in the lava! Oh, oh he's still not in the lava. Okay, De wait, that's dangerous. Alright, what we need to do is pick him up and put him down on the switch. With that, his weight, it sets off the fire and we can quickly grab the key. And we have the big key, very nice. Alright, so now I'm actually going to cut ahead to when we get back to the room with the, um, the boss room. See you guys in a second. Alright, so we are back in this room, and as you can see ahead, that is where the boss room is. So we're going to head over there now. Now that we have the grappling hook, we can access this area. Very nice. And there's two chests. Um, I, one of them probably has a joy pendant, and one of them probably has rupees. I'm going to assume that. I'm probably wrong, but... Alright, I'm so far, I'm one for two. Let's see now. I'm one for one. Let's see, am I gonna be two for two? And the answer is no, that's a knight's crest, but that's also very nice. Um, if we collect a certain amount of these by later in the game, we get to learn an awesome new move. So, I think I'm gonna end this episode off. So, comment, like, subscribe, and stay awesome. And in the next episode, we're gonna go in this room with the giant eyeball of doom, death, and destruction. I'll see you guys next time, and stay awesome.